and thank you to both the Colombian and Swedish governments, the World Health Organization, UNICEF, and the Special Representative of the Secretary General on Ending Violence Against Children for bringing us all together today. The first ever ministerial conference on ending violence against children comes at a crucial time and, quite frankly, should not be required. But here we are. We are at a crossroads where the urgency to reassess and redefine our approach to protecting children has become increasingly evident. While the necessity has always been apparent, it is now time to translate that awareness into meaningful action. So we thank you all for your attention to this critical issue. My husband and I recognize today's reality is marked by greater connectivity and advanced technology, which of course has many positives, but which also compels us to better understand how digital violence against children is manifesting itself in this age. At the Archwell Foundation, we engage with young people, families, and experts worldwide, learning how every aspect of a child's life, from their livelihood to their physical and mental well-being, now operate within an online economy that has the power to both shape and misshape our connections. While the online world can help develop strategies to protect children from violence, it also introduces new risks, such as from individuals who exploit gaps in outdated legal systems, which often don't 